So this is my review of the Temdan Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra Case 6.8 inch black made in China. And I, the reason I wanted to do this video is I've seen, I used to use OuterBox and uh, I don't think they're the best by any means uh, anymore, although they make a good case. I'm not going to say I'm not dissing it. That's what you want. But the thing that I like about this case is that it's it's somewhat waterproof. It's not perfect. Uh, it's, uh, well, let's just, I'll read it to you right here. It's dirt proof, shock proof, and scratch resistant. And I, uh, and it's a military, military standard 810G-516-6. Now I have no idea what that means. <laughs> it sounds, I tell you what, I've dropped, uh, cause I had this case on my Samsung Galaxy S22. For quite some time uh, and this this is the case that was on the Samsung Galaxy S22 and it's it's very simplistic because uh, you can see what the nice thing is about this case is it covers the entire phone whereas a lot of cases you know you your, your screen is still vulnerable for scratches and everything you see how it's got the front now a lot of people think that this plastic here is going to you know your touch, your touch sensitivity for the people that can move their fingers at light speed to, to operate the phone. I'm not one of them. I'm just an old fart. Uh, you know, they, they think that this plastic cover is going to uh, eliminate your ability. And from what I found, this was the old case. And uh, it's very simplistic to put together. You know, you basically, you put the phone in, obviously, uh, the bottom first right here. Slide the phone in like this. And then you just you just snap it shut, you know, and you just be real careful. Take your time, you know, watch a, watch a movie or something while you, you sit there and you kind of snap it together, you know, and just push it together. You know, there you go. See, look, look how easy that's going together. You know, you don't force anything and uh, boom, boom, the case is together and the phone's in there. Now, what I wanted to point out was the old case for the Samsung Galaxy S22 came with these holes for the, um, for the camera. Well, guess what? They improved on that. And I want to show you this. Check this out. So they send you actually two of these. These are glass fittings with a slightly glass back that fit over top of the cameras to protect them. So you've got all of this protection. And the nice thing is you get two of them with the case so that if you drop the case and you damage, well, you're, damaged, you're not damaging your cameras, thank God, because it's a thousand dollar phone, right? What you're doing is you're damaging the, this, this glass. And so since you get two of these, you can always just pull the one off. And it actually is just like a separate, well, it obviously is a separate piece. And then you can put the other one on. So let me show you what that looks like. So this is, this is the glass piece on the back of the Samsung Galaxy S23. And it just basically fit right down. And that's another thing. You see how the design improved? It used to be just kind of a square thing on the back of the phone it's much more stylish now and I think I get a lot better camera because I'm, I'm actually making this with an old Samsung this video with an old Samsung Galaxy S22 so that I can show you what it looks like on the S23 and boy I tell you it's a really sleek case and I uh, let's uh let's get into the directions real quick because uh, I mean I I don't know how you can go wrong uh make sure to remove any screen protector before installing <laughs> It's kind of like, caution, the floor is wet, right? <laughs> I mean, it always cracks me up when they put out these things. Or, you know, uh, it, when you plug a heater in, don't use an extension cord that might set your house on fire. Oh, my God. I tell you, I, 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 the people, I guess they got to do it, though, for legal purposes. I mean, there's a lot of stupid people out there. So then it says, please follow the instructions to install the case, which is crucial to the successful use of the case. Well, I just went over that. Uh, obviously, and then put the phone in the case from the bottom. Make sure the phone exactly aligned to the case bottom, and then gently press. Well, and that's what I was telling you. And gently press uh, the whole phone into the case. And uh, so that that's that's those directions. And then we got this here. Now, one of the things with this case, because it does have the plastic front cover, is it comes with these little uh, peel-off protective film on the fingerprint recognition area of the case before installation. Now, right 
here, I'm, I don't, I'm sure you can't see it on the video, but there's the finger protective area is right there. And they make a little thing that you can put over top of that. I just leave it open. Now, I'm sure this probably negates some of the water uh, proof, proofness of the case, but it doesn't bother me to leave it open. It's kind of an ugly eyesore, and I don't know why they make a, a, a separate protective area, but if you want to use fingerprint recognition, this is completely open to the glass frame of the case. Now, could you scratch the phone by not putting the plastic film on there? And I think that's their point. Uh, you could, sure. But I'll read you the directions if you want to do it. If you're really you know, adamant about the protection on your phone, you can add this. So, uh, and then step two, make sure there are no screen protector on your phone <laughs> before installing the case. Oh, and by the way, clean the phone before you put it in the case. Uh, that's, uh, I, I guess they got to put it in the directions, huh? I mean, and by the way, I use a uh, little, by the, by the package, I buy the alcohol wipes. And I, I know that a lot of people say you're not supposed to use alcohol, but I, I, I had never had a problem. And, and I like, you know, because you're facing, you're breathing on the phone and sometimes you're sick and you're coughing up whatever it is, that, you know, or somebody you may hand your phone to somebody else. I, I like alcohol because it kills all the germs. Step three, put the phone into the case and seal it. Use your finger to press the film on the fingerprint recognition area of the upper cover to make sure the film is closely is fit closely with the phone without trouble. So in other words, after you've put and by the way, they come up with four of them. They got four of them so that if you you know I guess if your fingerprint area gets too dirty, uh, and so the one the one that's inside the case you have to take off before you put the phone in the case and then you put it back on after the fact. And then add your fingerprint again with the case on the sensitive fingerprint recognition. And that's the settings that you have in the, uh, uh, in the phone. So just go into your Samsung Galaxy uh, S22, S23, or S24 coming out soon. And, uh, and add, you know, add that touch sensitivity. Uh, you, you can find it. I'm not going to go through the directions on how to that. The fingerprint recognition will not work properly if the finger fi fingerprint film is peeled off. Okay, so I don't use fingerprint recognition, so I can't tell you how good it works or anything like that. Uh, you do get this nice uh, microfiber cloth uh, that comes with it. I mean, it's, it's tiny, but I guess this is just meant to clean the phone before you put it in the case. And then the other thing is if you want to strap your phone on, you get this right here. You get this nice strap, and if you look on the case, oops, let's get the phone. Uh, if you look on the case on the front there's a little area right here see right here is where you would you would put the strap in I, I never use the strap because I'm constantly I, I just don't want this attached to the phone I don't you know maybe maybe you will and you just put it right through this little area right here and then you can you I guess you could wear the phone on your wrist and have it flap around I, <laughs> I don't know why why they provide that but I think it's a good thing it's always good to have options and then I wanted to show you the little fingerprint sensitivity so here's the three that you get with the phone. So I just wanted to give this case some love. And by the way, when, once you put that fingerprint sensitivity on, you've got this uh, uh, little, uh, well, I guess, I don't know, plastic thing to, to rub it in to make sure that, you know, the, the film is on the phone properly. You probably should just go around the phone and do the whole thing. I'll do it again for you. I can Actually, I can see that it's mashing out some of the air between the case and the phone so not a bad idea and let's get this side here so this should give you better touch sensitivity by doing this to the phone and uh, and then of course you know it's got the, the, the beautiful thing is see how the port is uh, covered right here so when you plug in the phone so like if you do drop it in the water, the water's not going to, as long as you seal this properly, the water's not going to rush into that port where you get to your phone. And then of course your S Pen, it just pops right out right here so that you can get right to it. See, I'm pulling it right out. I'm not going to pull it out all the way. So I'll just put it back in. Uh, and then of course you've, your speaker is, is right here and they've got an opening for that. So to me, I mean, I absolutely love this case. And, uh, and I don't see it getting a lot of love on YouTube. And I think that if you're going to buy a case, I mean, it, this thing, I have dropped the phone. I mean, I don't ever do a product review unless I have 
Uh, well, and of course, I, I, I haven't done it for the S23, but for the S22, I'm going to tell you what, I have dropped it, I mean, from a ladder <laughs> to ground and bounce. I mean, I've dropped it from the car. I've had it on my, 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 my dog carriage where I'm putting it in the car and it drops and hits the asphalt. I mean, I have abused these cases and they work great. And I love the fact that they improved the technology. And by the way, the, it's dirt cheap. My God. They were running a Christmas special. I got it for, uh, it was, well, I mean, I want to say like 15 bucks for a case of this quality. Definitely give, let's get the case name, case name again. Definitely give the Temden Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra Case 6.8 inch black made in China case. It's the best. It's the best I've ever seen, and it's the best I've ever had. Peace out. Stay free.